Hi, Internet friends. It's Tim Schrock at Design Build Solutions. I want to give you a quick tip, quick bonus tip today on exporting 3D virtual tours you can do with your Chief Architect uh, account. So I've gone into this plan and saved a bunch of cameras around the model, whether it's looking uh, toward the rear or the front, whether it's outside, uh, first floor or the basement. I've saved all these and um, we'll switch to this camera here. Go into the tools menu and under active view you can edit the active view and this will give you the option to save the camera and give it a specific name which is really handy uh, for the chief architect viewer. So I'm going to name this garage and click OK. When I do that by default this checkbox right here shows that this camera view will be saved. When I click OK with all these camera views uh, saved, I'm going to do File, Export, Export Chief Architect 3D Viewer File. If you're not logged into the um, uh, Chief Ar your Chief Architect account already, it will ask you for email address and password, and whether you want to create a new model or replace an existing model, um, maybe you've made an update, added a camera, um, changed a door type, whatever. You can replace that existing model right here that I've already created. In, when you're creating this new model or replacing the model, uh, you click OK. I'm replacing and replace this testing model. Give it a, a name, give it a description, and then you can choose the cameras. So I have actually, in the model I've already uploaded, not included the garage. And I've set the front view as my initial, whoops, my initial view is the front view. So that's a handy thing. This is really important that you name your cameras so that it comes through in the, in the um, online model. Then I click OK and click OK, which I've already done. Uh, and we'll switch over and see that online. So here's the testing model I've already uploaded. You can make this public. Right now it's private and nobody else can see it, so I'm going to click on Make Public. Then you click, can click on Share and get a link or embed code if you want to put it in your website. I'm going to show you click on the View button right here, and it'll pull up the model in this page. This is what your clients or whomever you send that link to could see. So here's the model online. Click on the cameras and you'll notice garage is not included in there because remember I didn't in include that camera when I uploaded the option here. I'm also going to go to rendering techniques and click on standard. Now you can see the textures. Let's go back to cameras and from here you can just click one at a time and go straight to those views as kind of a hyperlink. Now you can still zoom around and, and see where you want to go, see what you want to see. I do like including an overview camera so that you can kind of get a spin around the whole thing. But there you go, uploading 3D models to your Chief Ar Architect plan, uh, Chief Architect account, and you also can show um, floor plans, elevations, and 3D views really handy. Thanks so much for watching. I hope this helps. Have a great day.